Hi there. In this video, we're going to talk about how to change the visibility of the components in your app. Now, by default, any component you add to your app is going to be visible to anyone in any circumstance, but it doesn't have to be that way. For example, in this trip planning app, if I only want admin users to be able to see this plus button to be able to create a new trip, I can do that by changing the visibility of this component. If I select this component, and then over here in the overflow menu, I can click this and then choose change visibility. And then I can change the visibility from always visible to sometimes visible. And once I've selected sometimes visible, I can set different logical rules for when and how this button should be visible. So in this example, we can say this will be visible if the logged in user is admin is true. And so now, if I run this app, and I'm logged in with a user who is not an admin, you can see that there's no plus button on my screen. But if I go into my database and change my user record so that they are an admin, like this, and then run the preview again, you can see that now the plus button is visible. Another thing that people commonly use the change visibility option for is for lists that don't have anything in them. So you might have noticed that when I run this app, it, my home screen looks pretty blank because I haven't created any trips yet. So what I can do is on my home screen, I want to paste in an image and some text uh, that says, you don't have any trips yet. And I want this to appear if the user hasn't created trips. So Problem is though, I don't want this to be visible if they have created trips. So I need to drag and select both this image and this text, and I'm going to make them a group. And then now in the group, I'm gonna click on the overflow menu and click change visibility. And I'm gonna change this from always visible to sometimes visible. And this group will only be visible if the logged in users trips count is equal to zero. So just going over that one more time, this group of this image and text will only be visible if the logged in user's trips count is equal to zero. So now I run the preview. You can see that we've now got this image and text appearing that says I haven't made any trips yet. So now if I click this plus to make a trip, I can add a new one and do create trip. And now, instead of that image and text, I see my list. And that's it. That's how you can set different visibility rules for any of the components in your app. 